YouTube, Ray here again with another video review. This time we're looking at Transformers Alternators Tracks. The box here, um, yeah, pretty straightforward box, nothing uh, special. Nice graphics here though, shows uh, the character in action, pretty cool. Back of the box, shows the features, car mode and the robot mode. On to the vehicle right now, before I waste my 10 minutes. As you can see, it rolls very nicely, rubber tires. It's a Chevrolet Corvette, very, very cool mode. Very nice uh, blue metallic paint job. Also uh, the logos here. Nice, uh, nice bumper. Nice uh, lights as well. And uh, the back, cool lights, exhaust, and the license plate has a small Autobot symbol. As always, um, several things can open. The doors can open on this one. You can also adjust these, but uh, yeah part of the transformation. Um, the interior very nice you can uh, see the seat in here wheel so uh, yeah that's uh, that's very cool um, also this can open up and you can see the engine in there this is a very nice mode I give it a 9 out of 10 before I get into the transformation, I will show you uh, this first. I also uh, ordered some stickers for uh, the Jazz figure. You've probably seen that uh, review already. All's done for this guy. Um, yeah, they're supposed to go on uh, the yellow tracks, but I don't give a shit. As long as it uh, looks cool. I have no clue where these are supposed to go, but this flame is supposed to go on uh, the hood. I think that looks uh, badass, so I'm going to put it uh, on him later on. Um, as for the transformation, open doors, open the hood, as you can see I'm uh, speeding it up a bit, um, you get a knife, anything sharp, uh, tongue maybe, um, and get the damn motor out of there, yeah, okay, there you go, um, if you try to do it with your fingers, you're wasting five minutes, just so you know. Um, Take the windshield, press it down, like so. Go to the front, and yeah, this is where it gets uh, really annoying. You have to pull it apart, and it's kind of a bitch deal. And let's go to the bottom. Okay, like this. And now we have to extend the legs, and yeah, very tight in mind, so. Uh, this might take a bit of time, which is annoying, but oh well. Um, get the doors out of the way. Move these up. Move this piece up. And it's so tight, it's uh, very frustrating to transform. Um, now, you have to take. Uh, the legs and extend them out so uh, yeah waste two minutes there as you can see I'm uh, pulling this uh, bit out now and yeah it's bloody tight it's uh, it's insane it's uh, fucking insane uh, I'm just gonna say I don't give a shit um, and the second one Okay, I got this uh, leg out as well. Yeah, as you can see, it pretty much folds up in here. And um, yeah, I did you a favor by not showing it, but uh, yeah, a lot of cursing going on there. Um, what we do now is uh, we take this piece, kind of move it uh, backwards, push this in. Same this side, push it up, make sure these are in. Um, go to the bottom feet, get the heel spurs out, both sides, and that was uh, yeah, the hard part of the vehicle. Now take uh, the doors, move these in, and you can 
yeah you can pretty much pose them the way you want but uh, just uh, leave it like that for now um, now we go to the top of the figure which is a lot easier um, ah, not sure but just kidding uh, these were on the side you uh, move them like that now you take this piece you have to move it forward um, what I found is that if you just forward this backward aha this will uh, unhook so screw the instructions don't waste time pulling this apart just move this backwards and it will pop loose um, move it forward a bit yeah these are attached so uh, don't worry about it just move it back a bit like so and get this out of the way and now to do is uh, we open this up and there's his head yeah you can see his mug move them like this uh, go to the front of the uh, vehicle take this piece move it down and this oddbot symbol to move it in there yeah there you go Let's click it in there move his mug around and now what you do is move it like that go to the back get these out of the the damn way and yeah I know this uh, roof doesn't really lock in place it's annoying um, what we do now is uh, there's a hinge here hinge there pretty much uh, take the hands or the arms sorry and move them forward same on this side take the arms move them forward and now it's just a matter of uh, opening them up and uh, stuff get the hands out and pose them like so and you can also uh, flip these out make sure this piece is uh, straight and now for the back yeah it, like I said it doesn't really connect anywhere but move it back and uh, let it rest on there move this forward okay there we have uh, tracks as for this uh, gun take the engine piece flip these together uh, get the small part out here I'll just uh, use the knife because I really don't want to waste uh, 10 uh, minutes on this piece of shit um, put it in the hand pretty much clicks in there like so um, as for articulation, the head uh, turns, this can turn also turn here, can go up his hands, um, yeah, usual alternator hands, fingers can, uh, can open up uh, as one piece, not separate unfortunately um, legs go in and out, forward and back, regular knee um, nothing like a twist here only there feet yeah can't do much with them yes you can turn them around and you can uh, get the heels per in and out but that's about all it does look uh, look great looks fantastic to be exact um, I give this, uh, this mode a 9 out of 10 I recommend you get him thanks for watching see you soon